Welcome to part 6 of Let's Play The Legend of Zelda, Ocarina of Time. This is Ron Moore, along with Mexico and Lady Zelda. Oh, hey. Six time WCW. No, I'm joking. It doesn't work that way. Alright, we gotta bomb these boulders out of the way. I think Link right now is trying to get uh, to one of the fairies. Gotta get to the top of Death Mountain, ECW Mountain. That'll be easier said than done. Oh! Look at him in his I face. I didn't see that coming. Yeah. Ouch. Ah, I fell. Link just got through defeating the Dongo's Cavern. Link is playing. What are you talking about? <laughs> no, I'm just saying that every time there's a fail, it's gotta be Mexico. <laughs> or Ramor. And. So Link should be getting ready to head to Zora's Domain, but not quite yet. There's a few uh, errands to run. When I was a kid, when someone said run an errand, errand I thought that they were saying Aaron. A-A-R-O-N. 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 I thought they were saying, I'm running some errands. I'm like, who's Aaron, first of all? Second, where are you running him to? What? Well, don't have a cow, man. Whoa, hey, that's... I'm running them through this table. Link, are you Slamming. trying to get PETA to come to our channel? And Link didn't even get no milk. What was the point of that? Got milk? Apparently, no. Got milk. You got me. Not me! Yep, it's June. Not me! Oh! Forget about this part. Yeah, you gotta use your Hollyan shield for protection here. Use it oh! Use it. Yeah. Oh. Right. oh! What? Still got him. Still got him. This, be oh. this belongs in the beginning of the video, not the middle of it or towards the whatever. Yeah. You were just crushing the device. Yeah. Maybe. <laughs> well, I guess only if like it's with Ravenous Spectre and J Man. I try not to use any profanity. Uh, yeah. <laughs> oh, I'm not J man. Uh, right, yeah. <laughs> All right. Yeah. Well, I guess Lady Zelda will be right back with us in a minute. <laughs> Lady Zelda will be right back. But but don't turn away. We'll be right back after these commercial break. Yeah. We're going to war the war zone say Link against Ganondorf. What about it? Destroy, destroy those sculptures, whatever they are. I don't know. I think it was what was it the other day? I was riding the bus or whatever, and I saw somebody wearing a, a Zelda T-shirt. I didn't see exactly what it was or whatever, but I noticed Link or whatever. So I was like, oh, there, I guess there's some hope for this generation. They know who Zelda is. Yeah. But the question is, do they know this game? That's Mr. Owl again. Oh, he, he's a real hoot. He's trying to sell us some glasses. Two pairs of glasses, $69. Or whatever it is, 59 whatever. I can't remember. No, this is not an ad. It's just me. Ad next to our video. No! We always go off script. I only write like two lines and that's like, hey, how's it going? And then the end, all right, that was a good video. Those are the only two lines I ever write down. Yeah. All right, let's bomb this place, bomb this wall, see what's behind here. Oh yeah, I think this is to, uh... oh, yeah, there we go, that's right, duh, Great Fairy's Fountain, I thought it was going to the Death Mountain Crater, that's another entrance, here we go. That fail. Ah. Uh... You get the bomb and you place it. And then it goes kaboom. Yeah. I think in that order. Easy dub. Easy dub. Easy dub for you. <laughs> Here we go again. <laughs> oh boy. Look at Link's face, he's horrified. 
I'm trying not to. <laughs> <laughs> well, his face looks oh. better than hers right now. Yeah, that that's true. Plot thickens, or does it? You ask me. No. Maybe. Link. You know, whatever backpack it is that Link carries, or whatever, I gotta get one of those. He seems to always carry a lot of interesting things. I just need it to carry a few things. Right. Not all the things that he has. It's like, all right, Link, what do you have? All right, I got some bombs, some swords, berries, this, Subway sandwich, golf clubs. No, I'm joking. I could go on. All right. But I won't. But I won't. Tell Mexico to shut up. No, I'm joking. <laughs> <laughs> we got a lot of thumbs downs. It's like, oh, man, Mexico's in this video. No, that'd be <laughs> <laughs> Yeah. Uh, Chuck Money will thumbs down it. There we go, the spin attack. Nice. I like that attack. Yeah. It just makes me dizzy. Yeah. Alright, Link, we get it. You use the sword. Let's go. Yes. Don't Show cho off. Don't chop at it. It's not a sword. You're not a sword. That's not a sword. This yeah. is a sword. Yeah, he gets the master sword. This is a sword. Now this is the Death Mountain Crater. Get ready, folks. Are you ready? No. Oh, that's right. You can't go in here yet because you don't have the the uh, Goron tunic. Not. We are not ready. We will be right. We gotta get back <laughs> down to Kakariko Village. Hang on to his talons. Hang on and do it well. And do it live. This Come part back. is this part is fun. I do enjoy this part. They're gonna build a, a high rule theme park, and you can actually ride this ride called the uh, the the Owl Kabora Kabora, whatever it's called. No, no. <laughs> so somebody in the comments will be like, "Wait, wait, is that for reals?" Unfortunately. Yeah. No. <laughs> All right, so you land on the roof right here, back in Kakariko Village. Woo, I have here, returned. Though. Oh, wow, there you go. What happened, a power outage? Yeah, like a Transformer blew, and it went out twice, and I'm like, seriously? No, we're not playing Transformers. This is Zelda. Oh, I, oh, you went. I swear I had nothing to do with that. Somebody <laughs> please slap Techno Ganon for me. Okay. <laughs> do it. <laughs> Jeez, yeah, I, Ganondorf is really attacking us here, and YouTube is going to probably side with him. Oh, Link's making fun of me. Can you destroy his channels? Sure, Ganondorf. Hashtag, no. hashtag Ganondorf Adpocalypse. <laughs> Alright, back up Death Mountain here. I guess if we got something else. Come on, Link, when are you going to go, when are you going to head to freaking Zora's Domain? Yeah, Link, then I'll actually have something good to say on this commentary. <laughs> to get there. Yeah, I gotta do some more farming. Some more farming. Yeah. Oh! <gasps> Jeez. Oh, holy. Magic jar. Because we've never seen that before, so let's celebrate it. Celebrate. Good times. Ah, Come that's on. what he's doing. Getting the gold sculpture. <laughs> oh, well, you can't get it yet, because you gotta get the boomerang to grab it. I, I love much boomerang. Left. That's not a boomerang. This is a boomerang. <laughs> what goes around comes around. That's another Al Bundy joke. An episode. He tells this fat this fat woman goes, "This ain't over with Bundy. What goes around comes around." He goes, "Well, judging by your orbit, I got another ten years." Oh. <laughs> oh. Sounds like a Mortal Kombat 2 scream. Oh! Oh, what's in here now? Oh. 
Maybe some more rupees. Some rupees? Yep. Uh, 50 rupees. Oh, he's maxed out now. Rupees are groovy. Yep. He maxed out his discover card. I was a part yeah, of Link. Yeah. I was part of Zelda the MSN group years ago. I forgot about the currency in India. I said, that'd be, well, nah, there's no rupees in real life, but that'd be cool or something like that. And this one fanboy got mad. There are two rupees! There's rupees in India! I'm like, geez, okay, I was wrong. Sorry. But uh, stop, yeah. stop being a fangirl. There are two rupees! The moment you are wrong on the internet, somebody will rush in and correct you every time. That's just how the internet works, people. Yeah. Every freaking time. Yeah, or how like you're not doing good in your live stream and someone comes in, oh, you suck. Uh, or if you're cheating against the CPU. Man, what are you cheating for? Like I have one, someone one time in my uh, Mario Brothers Marathon, Mario 1, 2, and 3, I was uh, cheating because I, I was having controller lag. I said, man, I'm going to even up the challenge a little bit. So I was using uh, Invincibility in Mario 2. And someone came in I never heard of. And he goes, oh, what, what do you mean? This douchebag's cheating. Turn off Invincibility. Dude, what are you doing? Why are you cheating? And finally, Goblin or somebody banned him from the chat room. Or Danny might have banned him. <laughs> and, Seriously? Uh, yeah. It's like, yeah. I'm cheating against the CPU, first of all. If it was against a second player or multiplayer online person, then I can understand, you know, being mad because that's not cool cheating in multiplayer. It all, it all goes back, if I remember, I'll, I'll plug uh, Raven Inspector's video where he rants about cheating in single player games. Meaning, if it's your people game, you can cheat video. all you want. Watch that video, people. Seriously. That's what made me subscribe to him. That's how I got to know Raptor Spectre. Is that video right there? All right, I want to check that out now. Yeah, it's called it's called cheating in single player games, and he does a freaking hilarious rant. I'm not going to spoil it. Just listen to it. He's uh, especially just one part where he talks about people that say get good. It was just funny how he reenacted that. Could you imagine um, running into a tech titan in real life? Oh, I'd be so horrified. I mean, I hate spiders as it is. Not so much the spiders, just like, just the venom that's inside of them. I don't want them to bite yeah, me. I've seen a tech titan. I wonder if tech titans have venom. Venoms. Mm, that's a good venoms. Question. Plural. Somebody in the comments venoms. will correct us. They'll be like, yes, they do. Yes, they really? do. I can't believe you don't know that. Oh my god, subscribe to Mexico. <laughs> You're incredible, destroying the Dodongos. <laughs> Do you mind if I call you Big Brother? Do you mind shutting up? Oh, I can't believe I snorted. <laughs> Mrs. Urko now with us. Ha 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 ha. Did I do that? I, th there's this rap song, I think it's from uh, Master P, I'm not sure. It goes, uh, it ain't my fault. Did I do that? And um, I looked at Lu yeah. it was Lewis, Venom 22, playing that in his truck. And I said, what is this, Steve Urkel turning heel on ECW? Is this his interest music? We were all waiting for that one day to happen, Steve Urkel to turn heel. It turn heel. Happen. That'd be his interest music in ECW if he was a heel. Uh, it ain't my fault. <laughs> Did I do that? He comes out looking like Stefan Urkel, but more of an evil version of Stefan Urkel. Just looking all thuggish. Remember the episode where he was undercover as a gangbanger to infiltrate the dragons that, that beat up Eddie Winslow? That's the first thing that came to my mind when we, I started thinking about that. Yep, I do remember that. He would look like that, except he would talk like Stefan all ghetto and all that stuff. That'd be cool. And ECW Steve Urkel, he'd go to the Transformation Chamber, but then one day he, Laura or someone convinces him to turn face again, so he'll go back into the chamber. Now he'll be a tweener, because he'll go to the chamber and transform to face and heel and whatever he wants. Just like Big Show. Yeah. Oh. Now, Big Show has his own, uh, forget Elimination Chamber, WWE Transformation Chamber live on pay-per-view. So I, it's all, in the start of the pay-per-view, he was face, and then in the middle, he was heel, and then he turned back face, and by the end, he was heel again, and by the time he left the arena, who the hell knows? Yeah, Big Show versus, uh, St Steve Urkel. Who's the better tweener? Ooh. Follow me on tweener. Wait. <laughs> Alright, let's get out of here. Ah, my eyes! Ah, oh, jeez. You're killing me, Smalls. Yeah. I work with someone, somebody that would say stuff like, Ronnie, you're killing me. And she sounds just like that. We all just laugh whenever I imitate her. There's always somebody like that that'll do that. They'll be like, you're killing me. And yeah. I'm like, well, 
It's yeah. intentional, just yeah. so you know. You're killing me, well, Biggs. No. Just embrace it, man. Well, yeah. that's kind of the point. That's why I'm doing it. Just letting you know. <laughs> I was gonna say oh, something. You... Oh, sorry. Go ahead. Uh, what would you say that your most favorite version of Castle Town is? Like in what game? Uh, man, I'm about to say Twilight Princess. That is a good one. I'll admit. What is yours? Um, to be entirely honest, I think it's a toss-up between Ocarina and Twilight Princess, but. Probably Twilight Princess just for the ladder. <laughs> uh, I'm trying to remember the ladder. Oh, wait, a ladder? At least you can pick up cats and dogs. <laughs> oh, yeah. Ooh. I'm trying to remember what part you're talking about, the ladder. We did the LP on this channel back in 2016, or no? Yeah, the end of 2016, early 2017, if you want to check that out. Cause that was celebrating the 10th anniversary of its release in North America. Yeah, I tripped out on that. I was like, whoa, 10 years. Wow. I remember I had mine in reserve since June 2005. And it finally came out on GameCube December 2006. No kidding. And I finally got it out. And then my boss calls me into work. No, not me. Now I had caller ID. I could have just said nope and not answer, but I liked him. I liked the job. I helped him out. And I said, you know what? When I get off work, I have all the time to play it because I can stay up all night and play it. So that's what I did. Hey, there e you go. ECW Princess. It had a funny acronym, though. The Legend of Zelda TP. Okay. Wake up, Victoria. Yeah, you can't you can't pull a Jeff. You can't just fall asleep during the video. Maybe yeah, I yeah, <laughs> yeah. And seriously, well, Jeff, Jeff would li not during commentary on thing, but literally fall asleep during uh, like uh, Skype conversations back then. To where the first time that happened, me and J Man or whoever it was, we thought something ha was wrong because he was still on the call. And he would not respond. We thought like, did did he die or what the heck happened? Jeff, are you there? Yeah, maybe he <laughs> I'm turned sorry. Into a spaghetti monster. <laughs> sorry, I fell asleep. <laughs> Dang, if you're not that tired, you could should have said something. We let you go. We can oh, take a hint. It's me. Nice. It's me, Austin. I'm an ECW. AEW. AEW. This me's right here. Reminds me of uh, some old song I heard it years ago. She'll be coming around the mountain when she... No, I end it. <laughs> hey, I can't Aww. think. She'll be coming around Death Mountain when she comes. Hey, I like that version. Who is she? Malin? Zelda? We'll make a ROM hack of that. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Love it. Yeah. I like the... That'd be cool if this game had like... Or someone would probably make a ROM where you could play as a Goron or a Zora. I mean, like Majora's Mask is like that, but I mean, like, do it for Ocarina of Time. That'd be cool. Yes. Do it, and then do it live. Yeah, Nintendo do it live. Hire this guy. Yeah. They'll probably just put a copyright claim on me for mentioning it. Wow. All right. I would say I'm shocked, but yeah, that that tends to happen. Nice, you too. You're a winner. You are a winner. Not an Oscar Mayer wiener? <laughs> right. That would be better. Alright, got the one. bomb chew. Yes! You got the thing! Alright, back to the market. That's that woman with the dogs. The yeah, right. Well, Link did. Ah, here it is. The Happy Mask Shop is open. My name is Lonk, and I'm going to save the world. <laughs> Creepy face. Shut up, Jeff. <laughs> Darn it. Snorted again. Hey, you know what? I'll see you in Majora's Mask. You'll be begging for my masks then. Oh. No, just... Wait, wait, wait. Where's the Majora's Mask at? I want to buy that. The Michael Keaton Mask. You, you borrowed a Keaton, Keaton Mask. mask. You're, You're not, not Batman. Batman. Wait. wait. 
Pika. Pika. Wait, what? Pikachu no. mask. Pika who? No. <laughs> Pikaboo. Pikaboo. Yeah. All right, I'm looking at my script. I haven't said anything that I said I was gonna say, so I'm just gonna throw it away. <laughs> SC2K, unscripted, uncut, uncensored. 99.999% unscripted. Yeah. Do we come in DVD form now? Are we coming, uh, uh, video CD. The VHS form. VHS and video CD. Now, let's skip Roger's channel, never mind. What would really be funny is if we came on VHS. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Actually, I have some of my old lost footage I deleted from my channels are on VHS in my closet. What? Yep. But I, I gotta get a, I gotta get a capture device first before I re-upload those. I, I don't know. I might put it under playlist with run more archives. Oh, nice. Yeah. So hopefully one day. Yeah. I'm right, gonna get another uh, power from uh, one of the fairies. The fairies that also make appearance in Resident Evil when I die. <laughs> when I first seen these fairies right here, I'm like, whoa, uh, what? It's creepy. You and me both. Oh, a magic spell. Bad. Magic spell now. <laughs> oh, Den's fire. I Den's fire. Streets of fire. Did you get Den's fire? Yeah, everybody talk weird. Not normal. Yes, Dan's for you. I'm doing the doily boy. I'm out again. Yeah. All right, I'm just gonna talk normal. I don't want to offend anybody. Not that I haven't already. Breathing in 2019 will offend somebody. Yes. So will sneezing. Yep. Oh, that'll Pick out you. Here we go, the demonstration of dance for ya! Let's do it. Nice. We're gonna do it. Do it. Do it. Oh man, you don't cut sounds like that. That's messed up. Oh. Well, what are you doing? Oh. Link is trying to get him thrown out. He's getting yeah. himself thrown out so that he can exit out of here quicker. You know what I really love is seeing these memes on the internet of Link going, Hey, my name is Link and this is Jackass. Oh. Uh, I don't know. I don't think I've seen those. I've seen oh. one of those. It's brilliant. I'm telling you. Wait, so Link and Ryan Dunn do something together? That would be awesome. Or would it? The Link and no, Billy Gunn, that'd be something. The one Billy Gunn. The one Billy Gunn. That was stupid. I know. It was so horrible. But it stuck in my head forever. It's, it's just music. I like I kinda liked Billy and Chuck though, because they were funny. That was hilarious. Yeah, the they were like ambiguously gay. But then they made it look like they actually were gay. I'm like, wait a minute, it's supposed to be ambiguous with it. That's not funny anymore. And then to where I guess like and then that they had the wedding and Rico was supposed to like have them get married. Remember like, that? Whoa, 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 whoa! We're not. <laughs> but it was that was a cool moment though, because Bischoff was the the preacher in disguise with all that Hollywood makeup, and he goes, "What do you say?" Now wait a minute, guys. Marriage is supposed to be sacred, whether it be for ten years, ten months, or three minutes. Wait a minute! I three minutes. Yeah, and when he said, "I go wait a minute," I had no, I had no idea that was Bischoff. Did you? No, I did. Ah, uh, I, I no, I can't say that I did. Uh, I that that her. was a perfect uh, disguise. The way they did it, that was freaking awesome. And then he peeled, as soon as he said, "I go wait," oh, that's Bischoff. And I looked at him closely. That, that, I was ma oh, that's makeup and stuff. Okay, wow. I guess I had a feeling it was makeup. I didn't really look at the guy that much. I figured he was in disguise or whatever, but I didn't think it was Bischoff. 
I didn't watch Raw that much back then or whatever. I was more of a SmackDown guy, so like yeah, to, like, yeah, yeah, that was on SmackDown. Yeah, that's yeah, because he he invaded SmackDown. Him and uh, yeah. whoever was with. Oh yeah, three minute warning. Yeah, and then I'm like, what the hell is going on here? Who the hell are these guys? Yeah. I guess if I watched Raw, I would know who they are, but no, no, I'm good. Yeah. Watch here we go. We all the way home. Yep. Do, 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 do. So where's Domain? Finally. Finally. The Rock has come back to Hyrule. We got a fish. Now what the Rock is cooking? He's cooking fish. Actually, no, he's not going to cook it. He's going to just straight up take it to the Zora King. Zora, well, that explains it. Zora the King Lawler. Wait. Remember, when, remember Al Roker butchered his name. He called him Jerry the Ring Lawler, and Jerry Lawler was pissed. Yeah, that was. Wow. Seriously, Jerry Lawler said something about making fun of him. To my what an idiot, Jerry the Ring Lawler. Wait, what am I talking about? He's not gonna get the fish to the king, dumbass. He's gonna give it to Jabu the Hut, or whatever his name is over here. Jabu the Jabu 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 Jabu. To uh 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 Jonah and the whale over here. <laughs> give him the fish. Uh oh. Oh, this sucks. This be honest. Uh, okay. Oh, whale! Oh, whale! Well, then. Whoa. Inside Jabu Jabu's belly. So you're playing as Jonah now. Cue the epic theme. Done. This is kind of a disgusting Done. stage, but oh well. <laughs> Yeah, viewer discretion is advised. Definitely here, people. And the video's been blocked in all countries. TVMA. Yeah, no, that's just Mexico videos. So I've made thousands of videos, but they're all freaking blocked. Every my, uh, well, I think one of my Contra videos is, is blocked in Germany. What? Yeah, it's weird. Crazy. Oh wow. Your German fans Ooh. don't approve of that. I didn't appeal it because I don't think I have any German fans anyway from Germany. So I didn't Probably appeal not. it, but if it was bought in all countries, I would appeal to do something because that's stupid. And appealing that, well, you don't have to dox yourself. But to appeal a copyright strike, you have to dox yourself, and I don't want to do that. Ah, YouTube and their wacky laws. Yeah, that's when why I didn't appeal the uh, original Ocarina of Time parts because I have to get that person my address. Like, what? No way. Oh no. Yeah, that's creepy. Jeez. Here's a. Uh, I forgot her name. Rudo. Rudo. Yeah. It's entitled uh, Zora over here. My daddy says I can have this. And take me home. All right. Oh, Jeff. Well, I gave Sounds you good. the sapphire, so therefore we are engaged. <laughs> yeah, creepy. Why don't you go fall in a hole somewhere? No, I did that yesterday. No, I'm talking to her. Jeez. What nice. kind of life do you lead, man? Uh, ah, ha! Good! Game over! Let's get out of here! Oh, no! Adios. No way! I guess I'll go in after her! Oh, yuck! Oh, oh, boy. Are you still hanging around here? <coughs> well, yeah, I have to save you. I promised your father, even though I didn't technically... Even though Link didn't technically speak to him. Because Link never speaks anyway. Well, there is this one thing during this one time. Wait, so the jellyfish stay stand still, but the ghost ghost is not moving around. Oh, whoa. Tom stands still when you talk to people. I think I understand why they're called jellyfish now, because they look so jelly. Yeah. Are you gelling? Right, yeah. Where's the I'm peanut butter at? Jelly. It's peanut butter jelly time. So you gotta pick her up and carry her. Just like in real life. Yeah. Is this the real life? Is, is it, it just, just fantasy? fantasy? I saw a meme where it says, it, is it just fantasy? And it shows like Fanta Soda yeah. or something like that. I forgot. Oh, I love that one. <laughs> Ron, the oh, meme expert. Yeah. Shabomb. Shabomb. Watch out! Come on! Oh man, how can I not hit that? 
Watch out for Bubble Man. This is just one step shy away from a bubble bath. Yeah. I had to destroy Bubble Man in my stream last Saturday. That was a fun stream. Mega Man 2? Oh, oh, oh. Yep, Mega Man 2. I freaking love Mega Man. Yeah, check out the stream, Shameless Plug, that I did last Saturday on the channel. Do it. Do or it not. Now. <laughs> yeah, I beat the game twice because the second time it went to be on difficult. Yeah, Mega Man 30 years ago released this month in America. Nuts. You can't argue with the classics. Right. Well, you can, but you lose. Well, I mean, well, plus, you know, people might question your sanity. Which yeah. they do that to me regularly anyway, so, I mean. Yeah. You can argue with Skip Rogers, though, when it comes to Action 52. He, think that's a, he thinks that's a classic, but anyway. Ha! You know, technically he's right on Facebook. He said, I don't give a rat's butt cheeks what people think. Action 52 is action packed. Technically, he's right. Not my cup of tea, that game, but. Yeah, yeah it's not good action, but it is action packed. Broken action, but still. Not your circus, not your monkeys? Not my cup of green tea. Or sweet tea. No, you're That's not my bowl of soup, dude. Yeah. Oh, wait. Oh, ah. Uh, hopefully, <laughs> hopefully she'll drown. Uh, she will act oh, well. She'll wow. reappear on the platform, but still. Looks like something I would have done. Yeah. <laughs> wait, <coughs> make sure I don't that it don't come out in the commentary. Yeah. Too late. <laughs> you know, one time I made the uh, fatal mistake of throwing her in too deep of water, and then I had to go all the way back someplace and get her. Oh yeah. Yeah. And then she's like, "Oh, you abandoned me." Blah blah blah, and I'm like, "Uh, I did not." Well, this game has, is trying to teach you a lesson. In life, you got to keep your head above water. True. Sink or swim. You're right. But I can't swim. Well, you're going to learn or you're going to die. <laughs> I like that accent. That was cool. That's right. I'm going to learn. That said that. He made a quick appearance and left. That was amazing. Oh, you're going to die. That's right. <laughs> Get good, kid. He's go. Oh! Oh, thanks for the help. Oh, oh pff, idiot. He helped you up there, and your dumb ass wow. fell back to the water. I've done that before. Again! <laughs> oh, at least he got him. There we go. Sorry there for trying to count you, sir. No way. Yikes! I'm going home. Those scrubs always kill me. I don't want no scrubs. <laughs> a scrub is a guy that can't get no love from me. I can't get no DQ nuts from me. <laughs> Throw in the water. She's a she's a Zora. Wait, hey, wait a minute. She's a Zora. How's she gonna drown in the water anyway? Anyway. Oh. Well, here you have to carry me, even though I can swim. All right. I haven't learned how to swim yet. Yeah, but you can't die because you're Azora. You can't drown. I mean, you can't die. You can't drown. You can't die by drowning. Uh, uh, have y'all played Mortal Kombat 11 yet? I have not, no. Okay, no spoilers then. Dang it. Never mind. I think so. Well, I don't want to spoil it. Anyway, right, do you want to get spoiled in Mexico or no? Do it. Okay, do it, anybody man. listening? Uh... Watch out for the spoilers. Spoiler alert. Um, I hopefully I try to remember to post a timestamp when I stop talking about it. But, ah, fail. Finish him. Oh, and I was gonna say, um, uh, he, this one guy, he's he's like Chronica's, he's Chronica's uh, sidekick, and uh, but he can't be killed. He destroy him, decapitate him, whatever. He eventually comes back to life somehow. So Raiden kills him by. They're at this place called the, the Sea of Blood, and the Sea of Blood, the Sea of Blood is bottomless. So Raven. Oh, okay, I know about that place. He, he wraps him around this giant chain, Raiden does, and then like throws the anchor in the sea, and the guy goes, I think his name is Gyrus. He goes, drowning won't, won't kill me, Raiden. He goes, the sea is bottomless. You will fall forever. Sure enough, it showed him falling and falling and falling forever. So he won't die, but it'll be falling forever. So Raiden yep. got him. You can't kill him. 
Just throw them in the bottomless. Yeah, just like oh, the bottomless shit. pit and uninvited. Like I oh. into the pit, you girl. Yeah, the pit. That should be a. Uh, I think it's one of the fatalities. Kind of been one of the fan made Mugen Mortal Kombat games. You uppercut uh not uh, Onaga, even though he's a dragon, he can fly. He still falls into like this abyss or whatever. But I guess it's oh. too injured to fly. So. Yeah, they 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 changed the voice because at first in one of the one of the uh, versions of the game, Onaga goes ah, and someone in the comment section was like, "Man, that's not how Onaga sounds." <laughs> so they fixed it, and he actually says "f you" or something like that as he falls through the abyss. Oh man, I, think I prefer that. Yeah, that sounds awesome. Can you imagine that though? Falling forever, and you can't die. You just keep falling and falling. Jeez, that's uh I am falling for you. The Shockmaster Valentine card. I was literally just thinking of something like that. <laughs> that's I, funny. Hey, you know you know about the Shockmaster in Mexico? Shockmaster? He's a wrestler. I gotta put that in the description box if I remember. This wrestler named the Shockmaster, he used to be Typhoon at the WWF. And and WCW, he was the Shockmaster. And this is a real botch. It wasn't scripted. It was live TV, a real botch. You can find it on YouTube right now. All you gotta do is type in Shockmaster. You'll find it right there. Sting goes, The Shockmaster! Big explosion. Shockmaster comes through this wall, trips and falls down flat on his face, and his Stormtrooper glitter helmet comes off. He gets back up, tries to play it off. So now it's a meme. And there's a Valentine card. It shows him and it says, I'm falling for you. Nah, he's got the boomerang. That's not a boomerang. Oh, wait, yeah. actually it is. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Never mind. It's a movie called Boomerang with Eddie Murphy. Oh, forgot all about that one. I think it's, I haven't seen it. It's basically, you know, the metaphor goes around, comes around, and I don't, I haven't really seen it, so I can't tell you what it's about. I know it's Eddie Murphy that's in the movie. It's called Boomerang. Oh, ah, back to carrying a giant fish, princess. Yeah, well, not giant, but well, it is a giant fish compared to normal fish. Basically. <laughs> no, her dad's a giant fish. Hey, do you know how long it takes for him to move? A week. Yeah, you a know week. what? Yeah, uh, that that part, the footage was cut <laughs> out right here. That's probably why the person that recorded this actually cut it out. Ricky C probably cut it out because it uh, just, uh, I guess. Uh, a lot of extra stuff we didn't care to need to see, and plus it takes them a week to move out the way. Uh, the King's Aura. Ooh. True fact, people. True fact. Or it could take like a hundred years, like in Breath of the Wild. <laughs> Are you serious? It takes them a hundred years to move? Or is that a metaphor? Or you just uh, sarcasm? Sarcasm. Okay, I about to say what, what they did as a storyline: hundred years. He finally moves out the way. I, and Link never I ages. If, if I were Link, I'd, well, I'd probably get tired of waiting. But then again, he's asleep for 100 years. So, I mean, come on. Yeah. yeah. Come, come on, man. man. Hit, Hit this, this freaking, freaking tonsil, tonsil, whatever it is. Do it already. Alright, All right, they, they finally, finally got a hit. hit. I do, however, think that one meme is funny, though, when Link is all like, I just woke up and apparently I have to do something. Yeah. <laughs> how can how, how you get the fate of Hyrule depend, depend on such a lazy boy? Oh, I just woke up, man. <laughs> yeah. Well, good thing he didn't go back to sleep. <laughs> yeah. He's like, ah, oh, I'm still tired, I'm gonna go back to sleep. That Link's like, dude, I just wanna lay here, leave me alone. Right. Like, Oh, here we go again. Why'd you leave me? Your, your face, your face, face is inconsiderate. Well, actually, he's a boy, but okay. Dang, Dang I'm strong, strong as well. well stomach. stomach, take some uh, tums or something. Yeah, something. Link is the tums. Nah, and it's not working out. That joke was dumb, da dumb, dumb, dumb. Perfect. 
Now we're actually starting to go back on script. Yeah. I destroyed it. About just to a big bump. Use your metal blade. Use the metal weapon, you idiot. What's up? Who's more annoying, Navi or Rudo? Watch out! I had to say Navi because Navi's reading the whole game, but she is helpful. Rudo's just an entitled princess and won't shut up and blames you for all her problems. Where have I heard that before? No, nope, right? that's um, really So she's a Generation Z, or whatever they're called. Oh, uh, they're usually called um, Echo Millennials or some crap like that. They're actually going to start a new stable in WWE, Gener Generation Z. That's stupid. I can't believe they're going to do it. No, I'm just kidding. April Fools, if you're watching it on April. Yeah. We got two words for you. April Fools! Dun, 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 dun. <coughs> now, it'll be uh, Triple H's kids when they grow up and start their own group, Degeneration Z. If they're still called Degeneration Z by the time they get of age to wrestle. Well, mine's Generation Ooh. Y, as in, why bother, man? Right, yeah. I'm Generation yeah. ECW. Nice. Everybody wants to be an ECW wiener. Yeah. Oh no, some people are starting to become AEW wieners now. What? Yep. Alright, are we done with this dungeon yet? I just love how the room just pulsates. <laughs> right, yeah. Imagine actually being inside that thing. I know, right? That would be scary. With upset stomach and acid reflux enemies coming after you and all that stuff. I can just imagine Jabu Jabu out with his friends. Dude, what did you eat? Ron Mower. Uh, yeah. That'll upset your stomach. Beery. He tastes a bit gamey and ECW-y. Yeah. Okay, destroy the Beeries here. Those are fun. And destroy the green uh, tonsil weird tentacle whatever it is it's a better way of describing it than what I would say. Oh, oh. Nice. Looks like he and I were on the same path on uh, describing it otherwise all right now we unlock, unlock that door oh just hit so if you actually hit the walls of his stomach is it gonna actually hurt Jabu that's the interesting question I don't know that's some, some fanboy. Answer. No, it won't, you idiot! He don't feel it. It's not part of the game. Well, damn! I was just asking a question. You don't have to correct me. It's a rhetorical that. question. No. Yes. Just like your we face, you. rhetorical. Ooh. Oh, there we go. Nice. Ah, right, wait. Get the sculpture. Cause it's got the boomerang now. Arachnophobes, beware. Yeah. So I feel like there's a lesson in all of this, but I just haven't got it. The lesson there's is lesson. kill all spiders. Wait. That and well. bonk Ganon's head. Yeah, no, don't kill Spider Man. Uh, Mr. Stark, I'm not feeling so good. Whoa. I think the wind just blew from somewhere. Oh, wait, there's the uh, uh, water sapphire, or whatever it's called. I just love how she does this wiggle on Link's head. Yeah. There, now shut up. <laughs> Go get your stupid diamond. Yeah, Sorry. right? I had a brain fart. <laughs> so if I had a brain, I would have those all the time. Well, yeah, of course you have brain farts. She's got a hole in your head. I'm sorry. Thank you very much, Ravenous Vic. Now he would disappear. Anytime. <laughs> It's amazing how it wound up all the way in there. Right. That's why he has an upset stomach swallowing a freaking sapphire. Oh, wait. Whoa, what? Oh, well, he also whoa. swallowed a very entitled princess. An octopus. Yeah, that'll make, yeah, yeah, make anybody sick. Ugh, whoa. Bear 13. My, you've gained some weight. That he has. Uh, oh. Shut up. <laughs> That's the result of uh, Octo Rock divorces kids. 
Oh. I'm so hungry I can eat an Octo Rock. I want to say it looks flattering, but it does not. It looks flattering. <laughs> oh yeah, my that god, it is. I like this mini boss battle music though. This is fun. ECW. I just part right here. Ring. I think one or two more hits would do it. Oh wait! Be my ring oh, Ron. never mind. That's it, huh? Oh. You got him, sir. That's your that's your ringtone. ECW. Now you'll get tired of that real quick. <laughs> All of a sudden, we are the champion. Starts to play. Yeah. 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 No, Bohemian Rhapsody will start to play. That Ooh. Mamma mia, mamma mia, don't you let me go. Be a Ozzy Bob. I work with a woman named Mia. I call her Mamma Mia. Ooh. Was she ever sick of the pun? No. A lot of people call her that, and she loves Bohemian Rhapsody too. Dang. And she you saw ever the movie. Song from Bad Bunny. <laughs> I haven't. I have not. I never saw that movie. I need to see it. Dude, where'd you go, George? <laughs> where'd you go? There we go. Oh, it goes down! Yay! Yay! Another puzzle. You know what? At least this game isn't as puzzling as Oracle of Ages. Oh man, I had Oracle of Seasons back in the day. That's the one that I played and, and really enjoyed. I had a uh, purple Game Boy Color, and I had the game cartridge. Lord know, knows what happened to the game over the years. I think I have the Game Boy somewhere, but I know I have my brother's like teal colored Game Boy with Frogger 2 on it. <laughs> yeah, Oracle of Seasons is freaking ECW. I still have my original it's Game a good Boy game. Color. There's supposed to be a third one called Oracle of, uh... I forgot. Oracle of Time, maybe? Or like Oracle of ECW. Yeah, like yeah a, we have Age of Seasons and... It was supposed to be Time or something. Like, uh, okay. She actually makes an appearance, I think, in both the games where you just talk to her, but she's... But she's an Oracle. And, uh... But there's supposed to be a third installment to make it a trilogy, but... I don't know if they didn't have time to make it. Or it just got scrapped for some reason. I gotta look. I gotta do research on that. I'm sure someone in the Zelda group will say something. Yes, you idiot! It was called uh, Oracle Time. You dumb. No, no. And that's the world we live in, people. Oh, here we go. You know, it's like if a person is wrong, correct them. Don't belittle them. I know, right? Well, yeah. you're stupid. You should know. No, listen. I'm, I've watched live streams of people that were not playing my favorite game right. Hey, yeah, deep down it kind of fr frustrated me, like, oh, no, 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 go there. But I don't actually attack him for it, because not everybody's good at the game you are. There's Baron Lemonade, whatever is that, Baronade. Sounds like a type of lemonade or something. Berenstain, Berry. Berenstain, is it Berenstain or Berenstain? <laughs> Alright, this is a weird boss. Weird do begin to describe this guy. Whoa. I love, I love Baronade, but I also love the Water Temple boss. Oh, yeah. Um. This, look at it. Now it looks like, uh, when it starts spinning around here in a minute, it looks like a ride from Six Flags or a fair or That's something. That's what I was getting ready to do. Oh, well, look out. I like the Water Temple boss in Twilight Princess. Oh, that one. I like the fire boss in Twilight Princess. He was on fire. He's on fire. He was hot. Yeah. He's on fire. He hit three straight shots like an NBA jam. I remember like when you first see him, he's, he's chained up. He's like real dark and black. And then uh, I think we were like joking. Like that, that there was a racist comment. Then when he then when he when he ignites and lights up, we I goes, "Am I black now, brother?" <laughs> Gosh. Oh wow. <laughs> Best part of the video. Right? That was a fun part right there. It's part eight of Twilight Princess. Check that out. Tibbs. 
was in that. That's, he said that's when he started to really feel at home with S2K. Dang. Okay, Alright, come on, Link. Every video, but man, I really miss his presence on here. Yeah, I do too. But he's too good for us now. No, I'm kidding. That's not. That's not this. That's uh someone else. That's two K that left us. Never mind. Next. <laughs> You're here. <laughs> Metro cool has. Hey, I can hear you guys. Now, Tibbs would like to be in these commentaries, but you know, life. When you're married to work full time, that can take up a lot of your time. Love and marriage. Yeah. Love and marriage. Shut up, pig. Ow! Perfect imitations. Did you miss me, Al? With every bullet so far. Oh! <laughs> it's still funny we told that woman. He goes up. The woman goes, Well, I hope you get cold in your Christmas stocking on your stocking on Christmas morning. And he goes, And I hope you get slim fast in yours. <laughs> oh! He always had, he was, yeah, like, he always had good comebacks. He always said interesting thing. One of my favorite ones was when he goes, you'll be hearing from my attorney. And he goes, is that the law offices of Hagen and Dawes? <laughs> I believe so. Oh, nice. <laughs> That's it. Ugh. I just love how these bosses just, like, blow up or disintegrate. Yeah. Disintegration X. Disintegrate into something full. Oh wait. Nice, another hard container. Well, have you ever played um any of the DS Zeldas by any chance? No. Well, like there's Haven't. there's one boss in them that I like. That's he's called Skeldrich. Skeldrich. Yeah, and I just I love the mechanics of that one, because if I remember right, you shoot at his spine to bring him down to your level, and then you, like, um, attack his head. Ah. Rudo's still complaining, even though we saved her. And, whoa, ah! More women, am I right? <laughs> no, I'm not that'd be funny. If, that. That'd be funny if you made a kitchen joke. I think I'm gonna go make a sandwich. <laughs> <laughs> now see if Blue Rose says something to you on the S2K Discord server. Uh, uh, Victoria, are you turning on us women? But I am a woman. <laughs> a woman, yeah. And I'm a man. I can, do, I can do a thing. Yeah. Yeah, I want that spiritual stone. Gimme, 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 gimme. If you say nothing really, she leaves and the game's over. You have to start over. No, I'm just kidding. That would suck. Whoa, wait. Uh, no. Uh, well, I, I don't want to be engaged to you, but I'll still take the stone. It's not the spiritual stone of ECW, but it'll do. It'll do. I can take it to Jeff and he'll buy it. Yeah. How much would Jeff give us for that? Well, I'll give you guys store credit. Now, he'll be like that guy from, uh, what's it called? Pawn Wars? Or Pawn Stars or whatever? I can only give you $5. I can only do $5. That's the best I can do. <laughs> okay. Yeah. That's a slap in the face. Yeah. You know, I still wonder what people would do if it was the spiritual stone of ECW. Yeah. <laughs> Sweet Sapphire! Just the Rhodes manager? Nope. But Link got the third spiritual stone. Now the next part, Link, will now go to I think a Hyrule Castle or the, the Temple of Time, I forgot. It'll be interesting to see what happens in part seven. Until then, God bless and take care. Later. That's it. That's the end of the video, folks.